This is the big story presented by HerbChambers.com. I'm Stephen Smith from the Health Science Desk of the Boston Globe. We're here at a makeshift clinic where measles vaccine is being given. And we're here with Dr. Anita Berry, the top disease tracker at the Boston Public Health Commission. Like an unwelcome visitor from a bygone era, measles has reappeared in Boston. Why is that of concern, Dr. Berry? Well, we worry about measles because it's a very contagious disease. It comes through the air. And although most people who get it will recover, in a few people it can really make them seriously ill. People who are immunocompromised can have a really hard time with measles. Infants less than 12 months can get very ill from measles. And pregnant women can have miscarriage if they get measles. Um, Some people will also get some secondary infections, so we worry about that. Most people recover though, and it's just a very unpleasant uh, circumstance. The good news, if we can think of it this way, is that most Americans are vaccinated, right? So, in fact, explain then why we are having this vaccination clinic here today. Well, most Americans are vaccinated if they were born after a certain time period. Uh, The good measles vaccine, the one that really gave you protection, became available January 1st of 1968. So we certainly have people who were born in the late 50s through the 60s who wouldn't have had a vaccine available when they were babies and maybe getting most of their shots, who then could have slipped through. But in many states, they are required to be vaccinated for school or college, and Massachusetts is one of those states. So I'm pretty comfortable that a lot of people are protected, but there are probably people who have slipped through the cracks. For continuing health news, stay with boston.com health and the Daily Dose blog at boston.com slash daily dose.